Hey guys, so today I'm going to be talking about hosting and I'm going to be showing you my preferred choice of hosting which is a company called Cloudways. You can check the link below if you want to know more about what they have to offer but I'm going to go for a deep dive into why and how easy it is to use Cloudways for your websites. Now we go over to servers and we pick our server, we're going to set it up very simple, very easy. Now, you've got a few options here. You can select WordPress version 6.1.1, which is the current most up-to-date version at the time of recording this video. You've got multi-site version 6.1.1, and you've also got a clean, no Cloudways optimization, standard WordPress install as well. Now, you've also got WooCommerce, PHP, Laravel and Magento, which you can also install. But for me, it's always going to be WordPress. Uh, for me, you can name your app, whatever you like. I've used test and I've selected the project. When you select projects like, the like I showed earlier in the video, you just name your project and that is where the website's going to go. Now, along here, you've got DigitalOcean, Vilter, Linode, AWS and Google Cloud Platform. Now, I'm going to stick with DigitalOcean. Now, if you're launching a staging website, you may only want to use one gig. You can see the costs down at the bottom here are very, very low. For a website with traffic, you probably want to start with two gigs. And that is typically so that your website, when it's getting traffic, your server doesn't crumble. Now, it's a great starting point. You can check the hourly rate down at the bottom left hand corner and the monthly rate for using that space. Now, if you are lucky enough to have a whole ton more traffic and you need more space, you can scale up at any time you like. You can scale up that server right up to 192 gigabytes of RAM. But for now, we're gonna stay down here. Costs are important to any business launching a website. So we want to start off with what we need initially. And that typically is what you're likely to need. Now, as an SEO, location is important. Now, we've got the ability to select the location. So for example, if I'm targeting the Netherlands, I may want to host my website in Amsterdam. If I'm targeting the UK, could be London, Frankfurt, New York, you've got different options available here. Singapore, San Francisco, Toronto, Bangalore, and a couple of other bits and bobs in there. So hosting location, you can dictate by selecting that option here. So very simple, very easy to set up, and you can see the costs before you go, and then you click launch now. Now, what happens? is you can see that they're setting up the server just now. It takes approximately seven minutes for that to happen, um, which is great. Now I'm launching the server, step two, then I'm going to look at migrating my website to Cloudways, and step three, take my website live and install a free SSL certificate. All very simple and easy, with a nice video tutorial here to be able to uh, do all of that. Now, features to help you grow your agency on top of Cloudways. You can transfer servers and billing to the clients from here. Seamless team collaboration. You can add team members to be able to um, go in up here and uh, access the accounts. You've got 24 hours, seven days a week expert human support um, a human is the important part there we need to be able to speak to someone sometimes and um, you get free ssl certificates and you've got flexibility as i said earlier to scale your server up at any time you need as and when required so that is how quick and easy it is to deploy a wordpress website on that server and you can get the dates that that's been added and everything else. Now we'll come back to the rest in a moment. So within a few minutes, we now 
have our server set up. And you can see up here, we've got the application installed. We have the project name, any team members that are allowed on that particular server. Now you can basically add different team members for different projects and you can stop, restart, delete, transfer server, clone the server, clicking the three little dots there. Now, it's important to go in and understand what else is in here. Now, we've got access details. Um, there are several ways we can interact with the application. We've got an admin panel, username, password, MySQL access, um, and all that kind of stuff. So we can also go through SSH access um, over here, but we can go in and launch the app. Now, when Cloudways install WordPress, you're going to get this sample text. Now, with anything, we can log in and click on the admin panel and we can log in using the standard settings, which are given to us just here. So let me do that. So we can log in and we can see what we've got. And it's just the standard WordPress install that's on here. We'll be able to see some of the plugins that come, um, such as Bot Protection, Breeze, which come from Cloudways. Um, so standard WordPress install, obviously we can go through, we can add themes and go on and basically develop the website on this staging URL as it's set up just now. Now that's all good and well, but what else is in Cloudways that's going to help us? So we have staging management, so you can launch the staging application. Monitoring, you can see the analytics, the traffic, the disk usage, and all of the good stuff that comes from the back end of your website. And we can see that the standard WordPress install is using six, uh, 74 megabytes there, and current application database usage is one megabyte. Um, so you can see all of that kind of stuff there. We can see traffic, PHP, running crones, logs, and everything else. That's not hugely important at the start. Bot protection, that comes as a plugin standard on your WordPress install. And you can see some of the information here in terms of blocked logins, blocked traffic. Super important to make sure that your website remains safe. Security from hackers, bots, and everything else that may cause harm to your website is important to keep on top of. So that shows you, this little tab here shows you the bot protection and what's going on um, in real time. Domain management, you can add different domain names. Um, if you've got a domain name, you can add it in here. Then you can utilize that domain name out, uh, on this particular project. Crone jobs, we don't have anything here, but you can um, add your own information in here um, by simply just adding in the relevant settings. SSL certificate is really important. Now you can get a free SSL certificate through Let's Encryption or you can deploy a paid SSL certificate. The choice is yours. Now you may already have a certificate and you can go in and put the settings, but for me, I like a free one. So always use the free one where you possibly can. <coughs> backup and restore. You can take a backup of your website, which is important, um, and you can restore um, a backup of your, your website as well. Um, now, this is really important um, for security of your website. For one reason or another, plugins and stuff like that can become vulnerable, not up to date, and you know potentially plugins collide with the latest version of WordPress and your website goes down. This is where you can restore 
backups of your website. So backup and restore is a really important section um, that you may want to consider. Deployment via Git. Um, you can generate your SSH key here. So you've got full control to do that. Application settings, if you want to go in and mess around with the settings, then if you've got the required knowledge and experience to do so, then you can go in there and do that through application settings, migration tools. They've got their own migration platform, which you can download and swiftly move your website onto your new cloud server. You also have the ability to use Cloudflare Enterprise. A lot of websites have Cloudflare and basically you gain access to 200 unique locations for a global content delivery network which makes your website load to certain people in certain locations faster but there's a whole bunch of other benefits, DDoS protection, mobile optimization, and so on and so forth. And you can see the prices below for Cloudflare. And safe updates, scheduled updates, and so on and so forth. So you can schedule and perform updates in your WordPress application, themes, and plugins. You may make your applications instantaneously at any time. Um, you may automate that. Um, to run periodically at a pre-selected time, um, making sure that your themes and plugins are up to date. That is something you want to do from a security point of view. There's nothing worse if you're managing multiple websites and having to go in and update those plugins all the time. It is a pain in the backside. So the fact that you can do this automatically is another great, unique selling point of Cloudways. So that is one of the reasons that I like Cloudways is the fact that you can automate this. Now, of course, WordPress is a great platform. How easy it is to deploy, the backup and restore, the free SSL certificate, the bot protection, the analytics, the staging management, everything else ticks all of the boxes in terms of a hosting company. But this part, in terms of automating the updates, is really, really important to me. So a great feature and something that is the unique selling point for me. So there you have it, that is Cloudways. How simple and easy is that to deploy a website? So there you have it, some of the reasons that I think Cloudways is the best for web hosting, and certainly my preferred choice. Now a little bit extra if you want 10% off, for the next three months, we all love a discount, then you can use Craig SEO as a discount code and make sure that you take advantage of that deal. The link and the code are below the video.